Hey guys, welcome to day 154 of my carnivore journey. And uh, just wanted to let you know that today was a pretty good day. If you watched yesterday's day 153, which I recorded this morning, um, then you know that I had my son over last night. And so, um, so this morning though, um, I went ahead and when, you know, it was around probably like 11 o'clock in the morning, I went ahead and made like a, an egg scramble with some, uh, sausage and, uh, had that for like a, you know, a bunch of butter. So like butter, eggs, and, and sausage all scrambled together. And, uh, had that for like a lunch or like, I guess you'd say lunch or a late breakfast or a brunch, you know, wh whatever you want to call it. But, um, but I had that. And then, uh, for dinner I did, I had ground beef. I, I kind of did a little bit of a, it kind of tossed in a few leftovers. I took, I did take a pound of ground beef and I, um, I took some of that leftover beef broth and I, I, Put like a cup of that in the um the the beef mix that up added a little more garlic a little more onion powder a little more salt and then i added some of that leftover taco meat that i had in there but i didn't want to add more taco flavoring just a little more taco just that leftovers threw that in there so it was like that leftover broth leftover taco meat i had to use some of that and then um and then when it was all ground and you know all that good stuff everything was hooked in then I went ahead and tossed in some of that leftover shredded cheese that I've, I've had in the fridge for a while. So I try to do get rid of some stuff in some Tupperware dishes basically tonight. <laughs> so, um, but it came out pretty decent. Here's a pick. Probably not the prettiest looking, but, um, you know, it was tasty. Ground beef, cheese, you know, uh, that kind of garlic, onion, maybe a hint of chili powder and stuff. So, again, it wasn't bad. Um, I enjoyed it. But yeah, I mean, today, um, and then, uh, oh, uh, I also took a little bit of the leftover buffalo sauce and I had like about eight or nine pork rinds, uh, some pork skins basically like dipped in the, like I was dipping a little bit, you know, just dip them in a little bit and, uh, having some, uh, basically like buffalo flavored pork skins. <laughs> so, uh, as a little bit of a snack. And then I did have like a one ounce, about one ounces of cheese for a snack in between and um, some coffee. And during the whole time, my yesterday and today, both days, I've had a couple of cups of coffee each day uh, while my son was here. And, um, you know, I don't know if it's just was just trying to avoid temptations. I didn't let him bring a whole lot into my house. Um, he did have a couple like ice cream type sandwiches type thing, but you know, I didn't have any obviously. And that's about it. Um, I don't really have a lot to add uh, tonight uh, for my daily journey. I just wanted to make sure I let you guys know what I ate again, felt really good. Uh, I think I did use the bathroom. Yeah, I did use the bathroom uh, earlier today um, and it was normal. So nothing on the home front to tell you about there, right? Uh, but other than that, yeah, I mean, everything was good. Like I said, man, if you guys are holding back on the carnivore diet, man, you need to, I'm telling you, it's the best thing ever. I'm so passionate to help people that I started a website, allcarnivoreinfo.com. And, and I'm going to keep sponsoring myself over and over because it's imperative. I The reason why I'm beating this website to death is because I really want you guys out there in the community to be spreading the word and get your friends and family to the website so they can, it's, a, it's like a, I'm trying to make it a one-stop shop so people can go there, they can learn any health concerns they can learn about, any additional medical stuff they can learn about carnivore channels they can find, recipes they can find, supplies they can find, uh, health that, you know, uh, pro-friendly doctors, pro-friendly health clinics, mental organizations, everything that is so like all the things that are sort of associated and good with carnivore uh, lifestyle, I'm trying to all put it in this website. So that way, 
it can direct people to the right places. Okay. Of course, like I said, we do take donations, but I'm not going to, um, you know, profit from it myself. It's going to pay for the website. And then of course the extra money is going to go to special projects that are all carnivore related. Um, but in any case, uh, and there's a t-shirt. If you guys get the t-shirt, uh, same thing, any proceeds from the t-shirt goes, you know, into the site itself, but the t-shirt helps advertise. So if you want to help the carnivore community, you know, go to all spread the word. And, and like I said, even if you can't donate, I don't care about that. The, the, the biggest thing that you could contribute is sharing links. That means go to the website, see what I'm missing. All right. Don't just be like, oh, I like this video and send it to me. Make sure it's not on my website. But like, go to the website and look through each of the tabs and say, you know what? There's a video that would be perfect for this scenario or 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 there's this health organization that's pro carnivore that i know about boom put it in there like i said if there's something i'm missing or a video that you like a link or a channel that you like a carnivore channel let me know guys and i will like and let me know through the contact form on the website because if you do the content it goes to my email okay so if you submit something on the contact form it goes to my email and i can see Whatever you send me, the links, I've already had people that's been doing it. That's why you're seeing a lot of changes almost every day. I'm changing and updating the website because you guys are sending me links, but I'm not getting a ton of links, which tells me that you guys are watching this, but you know, I need some help guys. I need your help in this. Um, don't be shy. Like I said, it, it don't take much to submit the form, right? Uh, submit a link to me. All right, because I know you guys, you guys are always loving to share information normally in the comments. You're like, oh, have you heard about this guy or have you heard about this guy or have you seen this video? Well, send me the link. Send me the link, guys. Um, but a lot of you are participating. And again, it makes me really, really proud. I love it. Um, and I hope you guys will get behind it fully. You know, So I love you guys. You guys are amazing. I will talk with you uh, tomorrow. Bye, guys.